the predestiny. Why the Muslims are angry about burning the Quran if the Muslims believe in predestiny, which means Allah is the one who made people burn the Quran. Yeah, yeah, so Allah clearly says, look, this is, this is the misunderstanding to you. I think you're a Protestant because you have no knowledge even according to your belief. Because if you ha had any knowledge, you would actually agree with predestination. Uh, I am Protestant. But you're a Protestant. Expert, no. You're probably a you're Protestant. Expert, or you're a, very you're, 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 you're a Catholic who has no knowledge. How do you know I'm Protestant? How, how do you know I'm Protestant now? Because you reject predestination. I mean, this is... No, no, oh, no knowledgeable oh, Catholic will reject this. But um, if, if you're man enough, you can show the Arabic in the Hadith. It's, it says what? It says, it says what? It says written. It what? does not say fixed. What? It does not say fixed in the Arabic. It says written. What does written mean? When was it written? Do you know? What? What's written? Tell me. Go ahead. I'm, I'm learning. Yeah, do, do you know when it, what it means when it was written? Uh, no, you tell me. Uh, I'm, I'm listening. And don't worry, I'll teach you because you need to be taught about your own theology too. So basically, okay, uh, pre, pre, look, foreknowledge does, does not mean that he forces you to do it. Allah says in the Quran clearly, he says what? Mm -hmm. He says that Allah did not wrong you, you wronged yourself. So this is one, exa this is one example that we have free choice to make. We don't believe in free will in the sense that our will can overcome God's will. You don't believe this either. If, if God willed for you to die tomorrow, can you will for yourself to die today? No, you can't. Mm -hmm. If I, if God he wrote for me to die, I cannot change that, correct? If God wrote for you to die tomorrow, if yeah. he if he knew yeah. that you would die tomorrow, can you die today? No, no. Yeah, I can. You can? Yo, you are bro, you you are a jahid. Wallahi, you're a jahid. You know listen, nothing. Listen, 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 listen. I'm talking about your God. You the women or the man. This Bro, what, does this have to, what does this have to do with predestination? We can, I said we can talk about all this. You're running from the topic. We are talking about you're scared. Sperm. You forgot. You forgot. You're scared. The one who said to me, show me. Yeah, you're, you're, the one who asked you're, me to show you're you. extremely oh, scared. You, you, you are running. You are running. Show you. Stick, stick to one show topic you. at a time. I don't let Christians jump. I don't let Christians show jump. You. And now because I showed you, now you yeah, want to change the topic. No, you change the topic. You change the topic. Why is all knowing? Why he is saying women she have a sperm coming from her ribs? You're running. You're running. Is I'm not, I'm not discuss, said, I'll discuss this story. after we finish the, the previous topic. No problem. I'll, I'll, I'll destroy said, you on this as well. No, no worries. We will go. No, no, no. We're, we're going to stick to one topic show, at a time. You. All your viewers can see that you're done, diverting. You're scared. You can. Yes or no? You know Arabic, right? I'm learning from you. Go ahead. Okay. What is? Okay. What does one nazi mean? Yallah. I don't know. I know you, you don't. <laughs> Stick to the topic. We were on predestination. I'm listening. I just showed you the hadith in front of your screen. Go ahead. Yeah, I, I know. I'm not addressing that right now. I'm addressing predestination. Mm. You ran from the original well, topic. Just address this because you are the one. I, who I know. No, I don't have to. No, we're not going to address this first. You're scared. You're scared of predestination. Why, why, we can why, we can address this afterwards. Can, There's no problem. I have no, I have no issue. With this. I don't want to open it again. I have can no issue. Are you, are you, are you I'm not. Let, I'm not letting you escape from predestination. You're running. It's okay. I know you want to yeah. run. You jumped, you jumped from like five different topics okay. already. Do you, do you swear by Allah you will answer about this one? Yes, well, I'll answer about this one. Okay, he swear. Okay, now we go back now to destiny. Now over here I ended up cutting the clip because he insulted a bit too much. But basically he brought me a hadith where um, he tried to play this little gotcha moment and say, well, uh, Musa a.s. Fought, fought the angel of death because he didn't want to die. And uh, someone in Sahih Muslim and I asked him a simple question. Look, was he, show me in the hadith where he was meant to die, where Allah has, you know, willed for him to die at this specific moment, and he could not show me that. So I gave him an example of of Jesus. Why would Jesus cry on the cross? Because then he he said Allah must not be all knowing. Because why would he send the angel of death if he's not going to die? Well, I asked him the same thing. Why would Jesus cry on the cross if he knew that he would die for all of eternity? And then he cries about diverting when this man literally jumped like a rabbit on crack the entire debate. Um, so this next part, all he does is insult. And when I'm getting ready to explain the hadith after he spoke over me many times because he didn't want me to give the sharh, he simply just runs away. Let's see. He showed him, you know what, you don't, cannot look, don't make insult. a Judah Don't insult, I'll insult your whole religion. You are don't insult. And listen, you are just okay. a kid, let your dad... Look, he ran. Ooh. Oh my god, bro. This guy actually ran again, bro. This guy actually ran again, bro. He sent Moses, he sent the angel of death as a test. 
Exactly. As a test, I asked.